A huge welcome to our viewers from the Estadio Beira Rio, located here in Porto Alegre, Brazil, and home to SC Internacional. I'm your commentator, Peter Drury, and providing his unique brand of expert analysis, here's Jim Beglin. Thanks, Peter. Hello, everybody. I'm ready to see what unfolds in this one now. Lineups for the game. Defence can get it clear. Gets himself into trouble and he's lost it. Really didn't have enough to concern the defence. Sterling. Sterling. Shoots! It's bounced out! Loose ball, who's going to get there? Aim forward. on it who's going to make this theirs neither side yet able to force a breakthrough here he's made sure that that won't get through well played he saw that coming and it's Sterling Thrust towards the front line. Tried to play it through. I timed this run brilliantly, and I think he has every right to be a little annoyed with, with the passer then, and I think he's letting him know right now about that. Just a little more behind it was needed. And now the finish! Danger averted for now. He's done well to tidy up the situation. Decent ball. He's done very well to get to that. Oh, much more than a, than a routine save for me, and, and yet he just coped with, with room to spare. Cuts it out. Go back to the keeper. has got good distance on that looks to slip it through can he finish it's there deep into first half stoppage time a crucial goal perfect placement the one place the keeper couldn't reach now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. half-time it's a dressing room that needs rousing at half-time because in truth they've not really been at it so far um, if the pep talk works we may see a very different side second half we need to and the action 
is back on the way. Well, I'm sure the managers talk the talk, and now it's time for these players to walk the walk and deliver a rousing response to a rousing team talk. That's a throw. Spoon forward. Battles to win it back. Pumps it upfield. This defence is, is wary about opposition pace. So they're just not getting too tight? Yeah, they know that if they, they step up, their, their keeper could get a whole lot busier. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, at the moment, their chances of getting back in contention look slim. They're not exerting enough pressure. Simple as that. This could fall anywhere! Oh, terrific run to latch onto it, but the finish is all wrong. Oh, he can't be happy missing that after being put clean through. That's about as good a chance as you can get. Chance to shoot, tries to dink it in, hits one! And that's caused a worry or two. Well, with this guy and the talent he's got, you know he's probably going to try his look from there, but that one he didn't really get right at all. to get it forward quickly no no way through there well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there yeah and the vision to get him through was all good but the execution of the pass wasn't quite right but importantly he's holding his line until the very last moment and that will pay off and that'll go straight through to the keeper Clever pass. Away from immediate danger. Aimed long and direct. Knocks it towards the front. Sergio Busquets gets it back. He's there to get rid. Well, he rushed into that and didn't give anyone a chance to get on the end of it. Good clearance and very necessary. Tries lifting it over. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Well, he simply failed to just put a little more oomph behind that. Sterling. And there goes the final whistle. Always in the balance, and in the end, one goal was enough. They are narrowly beaten.